Well, like, hello there. You mightn't recognise me, but I am Stu Shaw. And yes, I'm actually doing some exercise. In particular, I'm riding a bike. It is the 6th of March, 2010. And the time is 25 past 6 p.m. Guess what my daughter is doing right this minute? Across in New Zealand, about, uh, I don't know, three or four hours away by aeroplane. She's competing in her very first full Ironman length triathlon. They've been going solid since the 6 a.m. start time this morning over there, which is 14 and a half hours ago. My daughter is still out on the road. She's still jogging. I don't know what she's doing. Walking, maybe. Doing her darndest to be able to finish. And I thought, well, dang, if that doesn't inspire me to strap on a bike helmet and a pair of running shoes, I don't know what else would. So here I am, making a bit of a fool of myself here. Okay, we're just going to do a take two here to see if uh, there's any video record memory left on this cell phone of mine that I'm holding on my very unco piece of road bike work. I've got no Lycra. I've got no carbon fibre bicycle. In fact, I've got a heavy old steel crate of a thing that I haven't ridden for two years and it's full on, full of rust. No wonder it still goes. So here we are going into a headwind now. What do you do when you go into a headwind? In life? And we've got some more people coming down the chute, Talpo. One's walking, one's running, or a couple are running. Come on, guys, we're here for you. Here yeah, comes she's the running. first one. Number 443, 30 years old from Queensland, Australia. It's Julia Shaw. Come on, Julia, you did it. All by yourself, 226 kilometers. Right. Wow. And number 1124, he's done 10 Ironmans. You are an Ironman. He's done 10 of them in the past. 52 from Auckland. Number 1124 is Roger King. And looking for a five-time finish here for number 852, Jim Swanson. Robert and Jim, way to go, boys. You are an Iron Man. And it's a good night if you're living in Taupo, four-time finisher, 60 years old, from Taupo, David Beck. Come on home, David! 